What's going on, everybody? Happy Monday to you. Hope you're having a good one. Hope you had a good weekend, really. Um, I put out a couple hours ago, <clears throat> excuse me, on the community page of my YouTube channel, uh, a little poll. Which did you guys want to see today? The actual, what is the real best gun in Modern Warfare Zombies right now? Or the Mauder Toten uh, Easter Egg Walkthrough? And you guys chose this. At the time, as you can see that I chose this, it was 79%. And you can see the pinned comment at the top of the chat. Uh, but it's even gone up a little bit more than that now. So it is like 82% of you guys wanted the Mauer or Toten. So if you're like, hey, why are you playing Mauer? That's why. Ghostface, what's going on, man? Been a little while since I've seen you. Eric, what's doing? That's what I voted for. Uh, the Mauer. So, yeah, so uh, <clears throat> if you're curious, again, like, hey, what's going on with that? You guys asked for it. So hopefully you guys turn out in numbers today. It's been a while. Angelo, what's going on? It's been a while since I have done this particular Easter egg, I think. I mean, not that long. I don't think it's really ever that long that I've done... Uh, some Cold War Easter eggs, like pretty much all of them. I mean, I go back to it all the time, really. It's the latest Zombies game. You know, well, other than Modern Warfare 3, but you, you know what I'm talking about. Like, latest round-based. Pugstar, what's up? Um, Let me pick... We're going to go with that. Now, let me make sure... I'm not hearing literally anything. Uh, long time no see. I've been busy and missed a bunch of your streams, but I'm glad I could stop in for a fun Cold War playthrough. Oh, it's all good, man. I know you're busy. Everybody's... Don't even worry about it, dude. It's good to have you here, though. Appreciate you. Uh, you know something? I don't... You guys the same... Like, every time I, I play a map that I haven't played in a while, something kicks in and I get that kind of like, oh, I remember the first time I played this. Like... When this first came out, I didn't... I had, This is a real conundrum for me, by the way. I don't know what I'll do this year coming up with um, with Gulf War. Uh, I'm good, Angela. How you doing? Um, whether or not to stream immediately or to hop on like I did with this. And like, okay, this is how you turn power on. This is where the Wonderfizz machine is and all the perk machines and... I mean, in this game, you don't build a shield, but stuff like that. Um, so it's always a, a bit of a, a a little bit of a pickle for me. Like, hey, well, I don't know what should, what should I do. Um, because it they'll, it will not too bad. That's good, man. Good to hear. Good to hear. Um, you know, you're almost guaranteed that it's you know it's the it's the moment that the, a new map cam comes out, the stream is going to do well. Contact but down. the thing with streams is you just, you don't really get subs off of streams. Uh, not a lot anyway. Um, uh, things have been picking up lately for my channel as far as, um, I was going to just show you the bubbles Easter egg thing. Uh, as far as like when I stream, like the normally in the past, it's been like, uh, so let's just say I get like a hundred views on the stream. In the past, it would have been like, okay, well, it'll end up like when it goes to video. Can I pick that up, please? For real. Uh, I might get, I'd just say fifty more views, so I'd end up with like a total of hundred and fifty views on that on that stream, as a video and a VOD. And now it's like if I get a hundred views on the stream, it usually ends up around four or five hundred views. So a lot of people are watching the streams like after the actual stream, they're just watching it as a video later, um, which is very good news. And just because for whatever reason, I, I don't ask me why, um, people tend to subscribe off of videos more than they do live streams. Also, as the video, it can kind of live on, and um, YouTube starts recommending it, and you just it just gets pushed, and you know, live streams as well as they might do later, uh, they're generally you know they're hours long, and 
they're not very concise because you're kind of just going for a general kind of a thing. Why is it acting like that? So videos might be better. Anyway, so I don't know what I'm, I mean, when this first comes, the, when Gulf War first comes out, I mean, I'm going to stream it immediately. Like, I'm just going to have to. But. Uh, what do I play on? I play on, right now I'm playing on Xbox, Series X. I have a PS5 and um, I play on, uh, well, we were playing PC over the weekend for uh, BO3. We're doing uh, the new custom map, the crazy place, which was, it was a good map. Um, if you have BO3 on PC, I would definitely recommend it. Okay, I want to go show you guys, just in case you don't know, you probably do know, but just in case you don't know. Uh, what's your favorite Call of Duty Zombies game? Me, BO3. It's pretty much like everybody else. So we chuck this out here, right? And they get underwater, and then I discovered I didn't. I still have like all the footage, and I never made the video. Uh, I'm pretty sure, like, I have the solve for this Easter because it's never been technically solved. Although I have solved it, and some of you were here on stream when I did. Um. Little spoiler Why warning: that Easter egg is not an actual Easter egg. There's a lot more places where you get that exact same effect around this map and other maps. But I won't spoil it. Perhaps I will still... Oh my god, my Molotovs were still here. Maybe I still will make that video. Okay, so we had that bunny part there. That was the first one. Is there... There's a bunny part here. Because we're going to go do that. The This little, you know, the dance club Easter egg as well. Got that one. Uh, Tempests were critical to my inversion warheads. Remember? The ones who were sent to the bottom of the ocean. You are nothing to me. I think we're gonna take the same tips. I think we're gonna take the same picking up random objects, but he is child with simple mind. They're being quite rude to us, the voiceovers. Enemy casualty. I don't like that. Then they mock us for picking up like the batteries like, oh, you're picking up all these things like, yeah, you have to, stupid. <sighs> when will they learn? All right, uh, let's save. I think we have enough points now to get down there and do kind of whatever. So let's save a couple of, at least a zombie or two. Uh, BO1 is Angela's favorite, I think. All right, cool, BO3, legit game. Yes, it is, of course. What's BO3 like on PC? Uh, it's actually worse for me because I don't have a great PC for... Uh, I have like a... Uh, an NVIDIA like 1660 or something like that. <laughs> so I don't have a particularly good PC for uh, streaming on. Or for playing games on. Um, so for me, honestly, I would rather, like, I still would love to have, at some point, I would love it if they, if they brought Steam to, like, the Xbox Store or PlayStation or both. They probably won't ever, but, um, I, I would be very happy. <clears throat> I, I would be very happy if they did. Because like it, it would just be optimized for the, con you know, that console. And... It would just come out better. It would look better. It would perform better. There wouldn't be those, like, lag spikes, those kind of hiccups, those little... Whoa. Whoa. What happened to the graphics? Oh, my God. You know. Did we, did we flip around without me noticing? Or is this the last guy? I do kind of love the mini-map for that reason. Although, I don't think you really need a mini-map in zombies, but whatever. Still actually comes in handy. Okay, so uh, I always forget this bunny part right here. Let's grab it. Do I need... No, I don't need to actually write anything down. Would be, would be good. Uh, what a throwback Mauer water mystery was fun to figure out. Oh, you were here, right, Pug? Yeah, you were here for sure. Some of the modded maps are crazy. Yeah, that sucks. Uh, that stuff. Yeah, I mean, um, it. you know, it, it does all right. The, my PC, like the stream, like it was okay, but there's always like little moments where it does a little, you know, kind of a thing. Like it just kind of, and then 
It's like it grabs and then lets go, and it's like, oh my god. You're just always worried you're going to get killed in that moment. And then uh, what happened to me yesterday was uh, I was playing through it, and the, like, hitboxes, meaning so, like, if you were, like, to go up to this and, like, search the debris pile, right? Um, you have to be in exactly the right spot. If you move, like, an inch too far one way or another, you're not going to be able to interact with the debris pile. And it was the same way in that game with, uh, the, um, well, with everything, really. But the important part here is, it was like that with the, like, the I teleporters. The and I was like, this is going to get me, like I said this, like, at the beginning of the game, like, it's going to get me killed at some point. And then, late in the game, I was trying to activate, I don't remember which teleporter it was, but I was trying to activate one of the teleporters. And, um... I can't, I like, I missed, I missed it, like, because, it, it, again, you're just in, like, the, ex if you're not in exactly that right spot, it just doesn't work. And so you're, like, click, no, oh, shit, it didn't go, click, no, oh, it didn't go, like, click, and it didn't go, and then you finally get it, and then all of a sudden you're in a corner and you're overrun, because it's round 20, whatever, and you're overrun by zombies, and then you go down, and that's basically game over, it's like, ah, okay. Well, that sucks. I don't have points for anything right now. Uh, it would cut into Microsoft and Sony's profits. What would? Steam being on console? No, because then they just buy it through there. I mean, I, I understand what you're saying. Like if you bought it through there, yeah, I guess that makes sense too. Yeah, you might be right. It would just be so nice to have. To or, you know what would really be nice to have is just a brand new, like, super streaming PC. Like a $5,000 PC. <laughs> and, uh, someday. I, we were talking about this. I mentioned this over the weekend because we, we were talking about that again. like Because we're on Steam, you know, doing this stuff. And um, just to rebuy, like, all of the old Call of Duty games that I have. Plus the, you know, because remember... DLC was a paid DLC back in the day. Uh, everything before Modern Warfare 2019 was paid DLC. And that alone was going to be like another 11 or 1200 bucks we figured out, right? Which is just kind of wild. Just the DLC alone in the games. Okay, so we have Brain Rot. We're going to wait until we have enough points. And I think it round... Is it 8 that you get the Panzer? Panzers in this game are just not scary. Can you not Panzers even in like the crazy place, the modded map that we played, custom map that we played over the weekend, can be kind of scary. Panzers... on BO2 Origins? Terrifying. At least the first one. Steam should be on console. I mean, I would love it. 70% prefer a four-year-old COD over the current. That's bad for current COD. <laughs> it's actually like 82%. <laughs> What's up, Mitchell? Is it round 10? I thought it was 8. No, uh, 8 is actually... That is, speaking of Origins. Oh, I forgot the bunny. Okay. I have, I think, four of the five bunny parts. Something like that. Uh, we'll, we'll get whatever one's... Yeah, we have just the one more in the store to get, I think. Hostile down. Get that open for me, buddy. I'd appreciate it. Thank you. All right, you can get out of my way now. Should you be taking those? Clearly, they belong to a person with anger. Corev. Ah. See, this is like when we were going back over the uh, the intel. I was like, I don't even remember Gorev. And now we're playing through this, and you're like, oh, okay, there he is. I think that's the first time he's actually talking to us in-game, though. Maybe on one of the Outbreak Easter eggs, I don't remember. Um, I'm going to have to remember all the stuff I need to do. I have the satellite thing, so I can put that on there now. I mean, it doesn't matter, Enemy down. but... We can go ahead and pop that on now. 
There it is up top there. Okay, we have the hands. Is that all we need for Klaus? Is it the hands? And then I can get the black light and do the numbers. And I knew it was going to be a goddamn new. I knew it, man. Oh, we need the battery. That's why I was saying we need to. Go, we need the Panzer. Okay. So let's go. Uh, Uh, we can go into there. Yeah, let's go. Let's go. Let's get the last bunny part, and we can go into the dance club and do that part of the Easter egg. <clears throat> wow, that's separate Easter egg, basically. Yeah, that was it. Okay. I was like, eh, should we get pack a punch first? I was like, ah, what's 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 the big deal? Watch, I'll die. Ow! How was everybody's weekend? Without giving any spoilers, please don't get spoilers. Have you guys been watching Fallout? Did you watch the full season? I, uh, I'm halfway through, exactly halfway through. I've watched four of the eight um, episodes, and I really like it. I'll probably finish the rest of it tonight. But I'm really digging it. I watched two episodes. I will fill many graves. Do you like it? Or like you haven't watched more, you just haven't had time, or you just you're not you're not into it. Uh, mine was kind of boring. I got to be honest with you, Angela. I, I pretty much I streamed over the weekend, and I, I watched a little bit of the Fallout, so that part was good. But. I haven't started watching it, but I plan to. It's good, man. I'm not. I won't again. I won't spoil anything, but it's. I'm digging it for sure. It's kind of nice to have a, a series that like I'm actually into again. I smile at your it's been a little while. And by the way, like I was saying, like um. I really do think I might have found what the best gun right now is in MW3 Zombie. Whoa! Like, that wasn't going to be a clickbait kind of a stream. But I, I think we'll do that tomorrow, unless I can think of something else that I would want to stream tomorrow, and then I'll put it to another vote. So keep your eye on the community uh, portion of my YouTube channel. Uh, if you want to be involved in like what, where we're actually going to stream here. I don't know that I'm gonna like do that all the time. Like, hey, what do you want to see? And totally leave it up to you guys. I mean, I might just be like, wow, I feel like doing this. I'm gonna do it. Um, or I don't feel like doing whatever, so I don't do that. Or you know, you get the idea. This is the bitter end for you. Oh, okay. <laughs> oh, they just ran right there. We didn't even need to do that, but that's okay. Uh, which door? Which door? Which door? One, two, or three? Which door are we opening? Uh, not bad. Didn't do too much yard work. Enjoyed the nice weather we had. Dude, we did definitely did not have nice weather over here. Uh, and definitely, infinitely better than the Halo TV show. I've heard, I heard that was so bad that... Okay, it looks like we're going three. Joe, what's going on? Um, everybody wants door number three. Wow. It's the first consensus we've ever had. <laughs> it's, it wasn't it, but, uh, it's like the, literally the first time we've had full consensus on anything on this channel. So that was great. I mean, you guys picked wrong. It's your fault that I didn't get the wonder weapon, but you know, that's all right. Uh, <clears throat> that's probably one. Yeah, it could be. I got so lucky. I think it was the second time I ever did this that I got the... Because you can get the gold chest but not get the wonder weapon. In order to get the achievement, which I don't remember what it's called, you have to get the gold chest with the wonder weapon. And I got mine on like the second try. And then it was like 20-something tries later, I finally got it again. It's like, it took a long time. Like a long time. How's Cold War these days? 
The grand prize, yes, that's what it's called. Uh, so we got that thing there. Uh, it's fine, it's good. I mean, it's, you know, if you liked it before, you'll like it now. If you didn't like it before, nothing's changed. I think there was one over there. I'm almost certain there was one there. We don't really need to find these beforehand. I'm just... We got a couple of rounds here to kill. Uh, so that's... Is this number two or three? Yeah, this is number three, right? Yeah, three. Where's this zombie? Back here? There you are. Jeez. I want to get Pack-a-Punch. I also want to take off Brain Rot, because I don't want Brain Rot ruining my rounds. Did you play BO4? I play pretty much everything, just, you know, from time to time. Uh, the one thing about BO4 is I usually, like, do it in kind of like a big chunk, because it's on my PS5. It's the only thing that I have only on the PlayStation, and I just, in general, prefer playing on Xbox. So usually when I do uh, a BO4 run, we do, like, all BO4. Or, like, at least all Chaos or all, you know, uh, all Ether or whatever. It has been... It's been a minute since we've done BO4, though. I, turn your... I, I like BO4, man. I think, like, Dead of the Night is such an underrated map. I think it's a really good map. You guys know, the ones of you guys have been around for a while, you guys know how much I like Voyage of Despair, which I know most people really dislike. A lot of people think it's the worst map ever. I strongly disagree with that. I actually really like it. Um, but just in general, I, will, I like all the Chaos stuff on BO4 over all the Ether stuff. The only thing that's better on Ether is the uh, Blood of the Dead cutscene. That end cutscene is amazing. <clears throat> uh, okay, let's go get Paps. And uh, what what um, what ammo type, alternate ammo type, should we put on? You guys tell me. We're we're taking Brain Rot off for sure. So we can put on. We'll put on whatever you guys want. But I mean, like Shatter Blast and Deadmire, probably the two best. Shatter Blast. I have to keep my eyes open for that. Shatter, Shatter. Let's go Shatter Blast. I love Shatter Blast. It's so much fun. Okay, then we're going to just get some perks. So let's just hang over here. We, like, we literally have to wait for this. Like, that's all we're doing right now is waiting for this Panzer. Uh, he'll come next round. Uh, is it next round? Or is it like 11? Do they do a thing? Because we're going to start getting... Um, well, it's not dog not rounds over. on this. It's uh, val mini Valentina rounds. What are those things called? Threat neutral. The red things that look like Valentina that's not uh, Valentina. Let's see if that's a double point now. Really hoping that was going to be double points. Get yourself some perks. Oh, we are like Michael Myers up in this piece. Just uh, knifing the hell out of everything. Okay, we can get uh, like speed call or something. 100% uh, agree with you about BO4. I mean, yeah, I don't think it's too controversial of an opinion, but um, I, I, I just, the only thing that's really, <coughs> by the way, what's going on, man? Good to see you again. The only thing that I, um, really kind of upset about when I think about BO4 is that the Chaos storyline didn't really take on a, uh, like it didn't have a better reception from the, again, community. Um, I wonder if it did, if Jason would have stayed longer. Um, uh, you never know what was going on over there and what he was thinking and what his whole deal is, really. Um, Dude, get absolutely destroyed. Uh, but I'm, I'm just curious. Like, I just wonder about those kinds of things. Like, what would have happened? Or, like, the whole Lee Ross and him teaming up. And if they actually got to make their standalone zombies. Which, I mean, outside of those two doing it together, I still think we should get a standalone zombies game. I think it would be the best thing. Tormentors. Thank you, Ghostface. Voyage is my favorite zombies map ever. Really? Wow. 
Nine is pretty fun too. Nine is a great map. Okay, when I get him, oh, we do need to get. That's right. Okay. So we're gonna go get Klaus because I was like, wait, do we need? I'm not gonna get any more kills because I think we need him to get kills, right? To, but he needs to upgrade himself. That's right. So let's get down here. Is it this one? Yeah. Pop that on. Oh, I already gave him the hands. I just gave him both at the same time. Yeah, it ended on a cliffhanger too. Yeah. It just would have been nice, man. It was a good story, I think. Yeah, I didn't want to do that, but I kind of had to. And then... Okay. Come on, Cloud. I need you to get in here, buddy. There you go. You get these kills. Go ahead. Keep getting those kills. There you go. Alright, let's make our way. Uh, you guys are going to have to remember this. This is the second number. So blank. And then whatever this number is. It can be right here. Uh, five? Five. Okay, blank, five, blank. <clears throat> uh, five, blank, five, one. <clears throat> man, stop it. <clears throat> Class, where are you, man? Oh, that's good. <clears throat> Get more kills, buddy. Blank five one. I think I could get used to this. Okay, let's go get the last one. Blank five one thirty one five one thirty one five one. You can't trust me. Oh, he got tired already. Okay, uh, what is it? Thirty five five one. Is that what I said? Why well, he got tired really fast? How's that not right? 35, 5, 1. Did I reverse these? 31? It's not 35. It's 30, 31. My bad. No. You will learn of my ruthless efficiency. 31, 5, 1. I just tried that, didn't I? I know I tried 35. I don't know. Did I misread? Did it look a little bit weird? Did I get it wrong? 3151. Okay. Jeez. Try it again. Try it again. <laughs> oh my god, no, not the double points. Double points. 31. Oh, we somehow switched that. No, Seven. Jesus. I don't know what we did. <laughs> all right. Well, it's all it's all good now. All right. <laughs> yeah, I don't know how I put that one on six. I didn't notice that. Oh, uh, I forgot. Go shoot all the three things. We gotta go get class again, which is another two grand, right? That's the first one. 
Dude, this this wonder weapon is just it's so good. I don't know if the chrysalax or this is better. Like the chrysalax, it's uh Oh wait, yeah, I forgot. The Chrysalax, I would say, is probably not as good, but it's only because, like, it's the... I just tried to re-armor like, like you hold plates like you do in MW3. <laughs> um... <clears throat> the Chrysalax is probably stronger, but it's only be the, 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 um, the melee part that's really good. So I might put this in front of that, just for that reason alone, but, I mean, this is a really good wonder weapon, too. Okay, so I need him to open this uh, door for me, right? But I also need him to get more kills and then bring him upstairs. So let's see if he's ready. Is your cooldown over? Okay. Let's do that. Here we go again. Again. Is this as fast as you can run with that thing? Pinky promise. There you go, buddy. Get that open for me, please. There you go. Okay. Now let's go. <clears throat> I want to get him upstairs. That sounds... Not like that. You know what I mean. <laughs> we need to get him. Why do you run so... Oh, I don't have uh, stamina up on. That's why I'm so slow right now. That's why. Okay. And then we have to do the lockdown. I forgot about this stupid lockdown. This lockdown's no joke. Oh, he's good to go, too. Pop in that thing for me there, pal. That sounds like an ideal task for me. <clears throat> okay, we're gonna switch over to this. Your death brings me at least some sort. Oh, don't. Now I have to get that stupid thing again. Oh, come on. Oh, give me the nuke. Beautiful. Take armor as well. Oh, I have another one there. Save that for me. Awesome, like a possum. Alright. So he is upgraded. Let me kill you. Okay, we're good. Um, let me just pick up whatever you dropped that I could use. Thank you. Thank you. Okay, I'm just going to jump over the railing there because you're being a douche. Um, the more you use Klaus movement thing, the less time he stays out. Uh, I think that is incorrect. <clears throat> Every speedrunner I ever see use this, like, constantly calls him in. And they manage to get him done in one go, so I don't think that's correct. But it's possible. Please. There we go. Um, and you know what? We're going to pack-a-punch this thing. Right off the Ripperoni here. Um, but we want to get rid of this... The blazer part. We want to get back to the base part. So let's just get this open. We're going to pop out here. We're going to use the rest. After she is dealt with, our teams can secure the outbreak zone. And then we're gonna pack a punch this thing. And then we start the basically the, the actual quest, right? 
Okay. Camos on this map were really good, by the way. Did we just start a new round? Because I know once you take a step into the lab, you flip. So I want to make use of this and get uh, as many points as I can. Without killing. Oh, okay, so. Alright, so I guess that's the last one. <clears throat> Excuse me. I wish they made use of uh, other forms of Wonder Weapon as well as Laser. Yeah, the other ones, I mean, none of them are... Well, none of them come close to being as good as this one, as far as I'm concerned, at least. Um, <laughs> so we have to... Do we have a lockdown here real quick? It was only a of time. And then these things open? Is this your feeble attempt to stop me? Too late, too late. I have okay. already entered the dark ether. My ascension begins. The good thing about Cold War is, no matter how long it's been since you've played it, you can probably, you know, like, you you can figure your way through the Easter egg, like... Even if you don't actually remember what the steps are, like, you'll figure it out. Okay, can we, can you open this place? You are correct, Gorif. Requiem, we need to find a way to close the portal. Before it is too late. Perhaps essence canisters could be useful. The satellite shows a few harvesters in your district. There could be special essence to collect. Okay. Design is familiar to Omega Design essence. Design is familiar. Uh, we don't have the one down here, so that's kind of stinky poo poo. Didn't open this. Oh, I had enough points. Okay, good. Uh, it's not here either. Hmm. It's gonna be the one up top on the, those buildings, which is... I mean, it doesn't really matter, I suppose. Oh, I put it in. Okay. Did I not kill? Tempest essence. Use this when designing our inversion warheads. I forgot you can't run when you're carrying this shit. <clears throat> I wish the Tempest peered more on this map. Get the freak out of here. No way, dude. The Tempest used to drive me absolutely nuts, man. Uh, in um, Outbreak. I just hate the, like, the, the constant like shooting you from afar then running away. Shooting you from afar and running away. Like, stop being such a pussy. Let's go. Oh my god. Sorry, Gorf, but do you know what this is? That machine can build a device that can open a breach. Think of it as a smaller version of my missiles. It's probably how Valentina opened the portal. Hang on. If we build an inversion nuke... Um, is it right above here that... that should close can one spawn up there? Back. I don't remember. I don't think so. No limits. The only thing really up here is the, uh, the tape. For the music easter egg. As far as I can remember, anyway. Uh, we did not do this one. Let's do this one. Can you not see that death is your only destiny? Okay, I don't want to kill everything. I don't want to be done with them just yet. Um... Carry it. Oh All right, stop. Um, I think the last one's gonna be by Speed Cola. What do you guys think? Oh my god! It's like a mini boss party down here.
Uh, did you get the aftermarket part out of the mystery box? Uh, aftermarket part out of the mystery box? Which aftermarket part out of the mystery box? By the way, that was going to be another. Uh, I don't know. I'm not sure exactly what you're talking about there. It's not here. Let's go check up here. I mean, I have all the aftermarket parts, like for the weekly challenges and everything. So as far as I'm aware, I have all of them. Um, for the BP50. Oh, is that even out yet, or is that this week? I I saw something. Um, did I see it on Charlie Intel's Twitter today? I can't remember. Give me the damn thing. Okay, there we go. Uh, can you ride the zipline when you have this? I don't remember. Yeah, because you have to take one down anyway. It is out now? Okay. I was going to do, uh, so that's not a weekly challenge, one of those deals. Um, cause I was gonna do, I, that's what the stream was gonna be initially today. Um, was to do, uh, this week's challenges for the, you know, the next, the latest Jack Converter, whatever it's gonna be. Um, but that comes, apparently that comes out on Wednesdays, which I don't remember. It feels like we did that a long time ago. The, uh for the shotgun, what was that shotgun? The KV Broadside, which was like the best thing in Warzone and um, and DMZ when, you know, that came out. It was like so overpowered, it was insane. And I thought it was gonna be crazy good in this, and it's just, it's, it's terrible. It's so bad. So Wednesday, that's what we're gonna do. Uh, so maybe tomorrow we will, I don't know, I don't know, we'll see. It will make no difference. Even if you found the warhead, it would still be too late. You are out of time. Okay. So, now is... Where did you come from? Now is when we do the... We have to call Klaus in again to stop the train, right? And we get those parts, and that's basically what we're, where we're at. So I need to save two grand. Uh, we're going to go get a couple more perks here. Just because perks are fun. So, yeah, we'll have that. And I love to have this because... Yay! Um, that's kind of it, right? Jeez, dude, that's really kind of it. And then we're on to, on to the boss fight. I mean, we're going to get, like... We're going to earn some more points and get double papped and all that kind of stuff. Come on, buddy. I think the CIA is building a bomb. Miss me? Cannot say I missed you. Switch tracks. Column here. Catch that train. Okay. But if I get crushed by this train. Look at this guy. Strong. What? Who's pushing me? Um, where's the other? There we go. By the way, did you ever wonder what happens if you just stay on the train? For, like, until it takes off again? Do you want to find out? I have spent years my life to Fast is like, I can't hold it much longer. Ow, shit. Oh, we're just here. <laughs> okay. Oh, jeez. Dude, we almost got run over so hard there. Uh, okay. So I got the bomb part, and what else did I get? I got something else, and then we have to we have to do the the computer right in in his in his room. We're gonna have to wait till uh, we get down toward the end of the round though, because I think there's too many. What was that? Oh, it's just an insta. Okay, that's fine. 
Uh, mystery box is the only way you can get it. Okay, remind me tomorrow if we're playing MW3 that uh, just hit the hell out of the mystery box. Are you scared of me? I mean, it's kind of a... Uh, we've talked about this a bunch. Why did I not pick up? Because it... Oh, okay. Do you want to really do that, buddy? Um, to me, your fate was not even with Cold War, there's not much of a reason to ever hit the mystery box because you have you bring in your loadout that you want. Like you don't need to get lucky and get a good quote unquote good gun. You can bring in whatever gun you want. You know, with your loadout. I am glad you did not so it's the box has been kind of useless for the last five years, really. Well, four. Um. You know, you you get the ray gun out of the box, or um, you know, you. I mean, that's really kind of you can get the wonder weapons, I think, out of the box. But other than that, like, what was the point of hitting the box? You had the weapon that you wanted to have, like you loaded it in with it. So, what do you need to hit the box for? So, yeah, just remind me. I'm gonna. I'll try to make a note of that too before. Uh... Perhaps government computer can access this router satellite. You do not have access. I thought you were Requiem Super Agent. You know, I could help you bypass the access protocols. Oh, I already got the parts. An antenna, some wires, and an electronics board. Also, some transistors wouldn't hurt. What do you mean additional parts required? Oh, he's recharging. I got all the parts though, didn't I? Did I not pick that up? Is that like there or did I not pick it up? It looks like it's there. That's the one from the radio in the electronics store. Let's just double check to make sure I actually picked it up. I thought I did. I did not. Okay. I blame you guys. Oh man, I forgot about the train on this map. Well, do you guys remember like who, when you were playing at the beginning when this first came out? Now it tells you which side the train is coming on. Um, if you're down here when it's coming. But before that, like, you didn't know. And there was, like, some kind of achievement or something or other. You had to be, like, get kills on the track. So you were trying to, like, dodge back and forth between. <laughs> and, like, uh, like I said, so, like, this is, like, the south side and the other side is the north side. And... Is it possible for a gun to die of neglect? I don't think I've ever heard the gun talk to me like that. I swear to God, it's the first time I've heard the gun talk to me like that. Okay. Oh, we have to hold it. Job well done. I have now hacked into the satellite. Access terminals are now available around the city. Knock yourself out. That way, I do not have to. Okay. Reich knew the war was lost. The end station portal was a contingency plan. End station. As the Soviet army marched through Poland, the Nazis sent theirs into the dark ether where they would wait. My father stayed. Blah, 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 blah. Okay, so this is going to bring down the... Like, Panzers and stuff or something, and then we get the Plutonium. The Nitratonium. Willy Wonka's Vibranium. Be careful, Requiem. Megaton will have corrupted the unit. You must find way to be contaminated. Meg, why are you so strong? Okay. Oh, there's a countdown. I forgot once you start this. There's another mimic? When okay. we recovered corrupted uranium, we had to smash pieces together at high speed. Peck had machine for this. Uh, but you are in outbreak zone. Use smart requiem brain and quickly, rocks will create a big explosion. Rocket okay. powered uranium. Making sure we were healed a little sure. bit before we picked it up. Why not? So there's one over there and then one up here. So let's go do this one first because it's further away, so that's why. I don't know. Doesn't matter. Let's get up there. Let's do this. Huh. 
You didn't used to have to unlock that. Why did I have to pay to unlock that? I'm suspicious. I don't know. Hmm. Okay, the next time we get 200 bucks, right there, by the way. No, you bastard. It's gonna double pap. Stupid money just disappeared on me. It's like my real life. Okay. Do this. The one thing I don't like about this Easter egg, and I do like this Easter egg for the most part, um, is that after you do this step, you do this step again, which I, it's kind of lame to me. I don't know. Like, I wish there would have been just like a, a different step. Not the exact same thing again. I mean, whatever. You see? I knew you could solve impossible puzzle. Now, corrupted uranium is just regular super radiated uranium. You should secure that in the lab. Uh, okay, Gore, thank you. <sighs> is not enough uranium? This right here? It looks exactly like the time travel thing in the back of Ant-Man's van, right? Okay, so he said that's not enough uranium, but don't we aren't we supposed to get like another Are, aren't I supposed to get some kind of quote to like do it again? Or do I have to flip around? I don't remember. I mean, we can flip around, I guess. What does it matter? Let me just go check the computer, because you can call it in here as well, right? Yeah. You should know, Valentina believes okay, so there it went again. All right. Orders that he is alive, leading her army. In truth, it is a dark ether entity known as... Oh, Corsair. dude! It can shift its form, it's manipulating 15. others. And right now, it wants to get into our world. It's kind of fun to hear these quotes. You talk about the Forsaken while we're on Mauer, like, talk about the entity and, you know, like, the little th look aheads, you know, that they give you. Because they, they always do it in, in uh, Treyarch maps little preview of kind of what's to come. I keep forgetting that double tap on this map is uh, 50, or in this game is 15 grand, not 10. Ain't too much damn MWZ, man. Oh, I unlocked the, um, that's something else we're going to do, um, in MWZ, is I just unlocked the push, uh, melee weapon today, this afternoon, I played one game, just to check something out. I didn't mean to really do that, but that's alright. Um... So I want to try that out as well. Like, I already have uh, the class I'm going to use set up for tomorrow. It's the, the actual best gun in the game right now. And then we have that push melee weapon, which I don't think is... I think it's just as good as, like, the Karambit or the uh, the hunting knife or whatever the thing is called. Um, that we have already. I don't think it's any actual, you know, stronger... I don't hear anybody talking about it, so it can't be that good. Off you go. And you guys gotta remind me to hit the mystery box for that blueprint. Or the... is it... does it count as a blueprint or the converter kit? Conversion kit. I mean, it's basically the same thing, but... You 
underestimate me. Don't want them near you. I also don't want Shadow Blast to fucking kill everything, so let's. I think we're gonna have to chill. We can get the. Go off now, go off now. No. A single shot unleashes great destruction. Alright, that's fine. We, we, can, we can do it now anyway. It doesn't matter. Um. I don't know if it matters where you actually call it in. We're gonna try to do it closer, like get him to go over closer to our workbench. I don't remember if it matters if you call it in there or over here. I think the first one always spawns in that middle pack a punch section. I think they always spawn up there this time too, so right? Yeah. So then I think we, we don't go up there, we just, if we stay down here they'll come to us and then uh, we can get both of the uraniums or whatever it is that we need. I'm pressing. Why are you not working? That was weird. He told me what I had to do. He gave me a path to follow. How could I refuse? Yeah, let's pick this up and again we'll go far far side first and then we'll come back. My father chose me to complete that mission. Yes, Valentina. Or should I say, Angelica? <laughs> and we should have. Well, should we get more perks? Should we? Should we? I think we should save the money. Itchy nose. Uh, just in case for during the boss fight. Um. In case we need to buy ammo, because sometimes you do in this boss fight. Or sometimes I do in this boss fight, anyway. And I have the uh, death machine in my back pocket. Ooh, I meant to... Oh, shit. I forgot to switch. We want Ring of Fire. Like, we definitely want Ring of Fire. Oh boy. Okay, that's alright. Now, once we do this, we go into the boss fight, right? Is that correct? Because I would rather just go ahead and flip around here and, like, earn my full... How do you think we knew? Earn, um... We from our contact in Requiem. My ring of fire before we actually do it for the first time. Longer than we have, and they left you completely in the dark. Are you sure you can trust your leaders? But the timer stopped, so we're good there. So we're just gonna leave it. That's fine. Because I'm pretty sure the boss fight just starts once you go in there now. Okay, that's ring. We are basically full up on ammo. <clears throat> I don't know, what should we bring in? Should we bring in a tactical? A couple of monkey bombs, maybe. Casimirs. I think we should save our scrap or whatever you call it uh, for extra armor, right? Because we're going to lose it a bunch of times. I've got to head out. Good luck in the boss fight and have a good night. All right, Pugman, you take care. See you again soon.
And if we don't see you again soon, that's alright, man. Just get your shit done. It's all good. We'll see you at some point. Um... Alright, whatever. Let's just go. Uh, pick up. Thank you. I think we're getting... Yeah, this this will start the boss fight. I'm pretty sure. Yeah, she's gonna come out with that now, right? Alright. Alright. Are we getting this done or not? Put a one in the chat if we're gonna be successful. Two in the chat if we're gonna fail. <clears throat> is that you? What Joe is a believer. Angelo is a believer. My name is Angelica. A H V on the computer, baby, on D Machina. I am here. I keep wanting to say Nitro when I see your name. The dawn of the new <laughs> one, one, one. So that's like begins now. Win, lose, win. I don't know. Requiem, your orders stand. Majority of her army and the Forsaken. Oh, up, up, there, please. <laughs> Wait a minute, I don't know how we didn't actually finish her off that first. Like, there's no way. We were hitting her pretty good. I thought she was no. like... When we got that immune shield up, I thought she was going to fly away. Like, we had got her already. And she doesn't usually do the same attack twice in a row. Has something changed? Okay, no, she's leaving now. See that? I don't know. Something about that was a little bit weird. I think that was a little bit off. Nito, Nito, you said that before because I know I've said. Okay, that's my bad. Nito, Nito, Nito. I gotta remember that. It's not this one. Um, maybe we'll buy. What do we? Do? Oh. Okay, whatever. I am the harbinger. I am the foretelling of his return. You. I mean, it's cool how you made that whole big production. Like, I'm gonna wipe you out, but, like, no, you didn't. My okay. And pop back out. This is definitely the hardest boss fight in, uh, well, no. Legion was the hardest boss fight in Cold War, right? For sure. Okay, see, this is why we saved our money. We got a little bit more there, though. There you intervene. There we go. Ooh. Ooh. Oh, I gotta remember, we don't have, uh, 
armor right now. Why are you immune? What is going on? Dude, how did I die? I had my ring of fire up. How the hell did I just die there? That's complete BS. I had ring of fire. Should have blocked all of our projectiles. What did I die to? That's absurd. Okay, I need to go buy... a oh, self-revive. Wow, that was... I honestly don't know about that, man. No. I don't even have enough. Oh man, we're like literally one health right now too. I don't know, I think we got hosed on that one. And that, just being in there took like all my armor off. Let's go buy armor again if we can before it. We get teleported to the next one. No, 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 no. You cannot hide from me. Fuck! Uh, we got so robbed on that. Uh, like, how did we go down? Absolute crap. Oh, I'm freaking out. Okay. Oh, now you're doing the wipe as soon as I come up. Okay. Oh my god. We're getting cheesed here, boys. I don't like it. I don't appreciate it. I need you guys to drop me some armor here. Why do you still even try? Fresh munitions. Just for the doctor order. <laughs> Give me your energy. I will not tire of witnessing yes. your pain. Please drop me some armor. Can anything drop me armor? Please? Okay, did we get her to fly away again? My no. Break them. Good lord. Give me armor, goddammit. <gasps> What was that? What the hell was that? I demand your silence, Horde. Uh oh. Okay, we're good. Dude, I need... You will learn of my ruthless efficiency. 
I need some stuff here. <clears throat> Every time I go up there, she goes into immune mode. Come on, drop a little. There we go. When I say drop a little armor, that's what she's dropping. I mean, they're dropping me a little armor. Dude, this one is taking a long time. Goodness gracious. We need to get a lot of things here at the end, too. Well, between these two next rounds. Like, just drop. What is, what is the issue here? Oh, <laughs> he dropped right in front of me and blocked me. What a dick. Okay, she's moving. Oh. Dude. Um, okay, I can. Great, let's get that. Let's go get our armor. Oh my god. So we have a revive again. We're good. We've got armor again. We're all right. Um, we're going to go by... Actually, while we're here, just on the way. Let's just get it. Just right now, let's put Jug on. Like, why mess around? We're going over here anyway, but we're going to get Speed Cola. We're going to get... Uh, PhD again. We have basically... Um... Full ammo. Can I? Can you not go up? Oh, you can't go up there. I didn't realize that you couldn't go up there during this. I really thought you could. Ah, oh, Jesus. It wasn't enough, huh? <laughs> okay, we wiped her out again quickly that time. So that's great. Is this open now? That Okay, great. We'll go up. We're going to get perks real fast. Real fast. Okay, let's go. Go get armor. And once we can get our ring of fire again, uh, we will. And then we should wipe her out. How did the likes go down? Did two people take back their likes? What's going on? That's very mean. Whoa, going right for the wipe. Wow. Not messing around at all there. Okay. Just right for the wipe.
Da 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 Come on, let's go. Show them our fury. I'm using death machine. I don't know how that didn't finish her off there. Okay, come on. Let's go right now. Let's be done. Right now, right now, right now, right now. Come on. Let's go. There it is. Jiminy Christmas. Boss fight, man. When you don't, when you're not in full practice with that, it can get rough. <clears throat> like the first few times you do it, it's like, ooh, this is hard. And then you figure it out, and you're like, okay. And then you take some time away from this this particular game, and it's like, oh, I don't got it. I don't got it. <laughs> it's like, ooh, okay. Let's go, though. Let's go. Frenzy guard for yeah, but the ring of fire does so much damage. I mean, I I, I use as a solo player. Ether Shroud mostly. Uh, Frenzy Guard is great because you get your all your armor back, obviously. So that is great. Um, but just with her, because she takes so much damage, uh, it requires so much damage, I should say, uh, in order to you know to defeat her. That you go with uh, the extra uh, strength that you get from. Um, Uh, with Ring of Fire, you guys know what I'm saying. We are not Your world See, I also forgot too that these uh, little red the things, whatever they're called, what are they called? Dementors. Um, even when you shoot them and kill them, they still explode. Like, and you gotta, you can't be near them. Sorry if I just blinded everybody. I mean, I didn't do it. The game did, but you know what I mean. Agents of Requiem, your ally, Raptor One, is now free. All you need to do is come and collect him. Where you a sight, sore eyes? I do appreciate your assistance, but regrettably, I cannot allow you to leave Berlin. That's with idea, Requiem. I'm trying to help you, but you need to be ready to move. Hurry! Get to the rooftop! Again, this is one of those weird things where Sam's talking to our character, which is Sam. So it's like... I don't know. I mean, it's not a big deal, but... It's just a couple of those moments throughout this game that happen, like that, and then on uh, Outbreak, you know, doing the Legion boss. When Ravenov's like, where's Maxis? Standing right in front of you, homie. What's up? Not so... Still haven't seen Natsu in MWZ, or the, at least that I remember. Valentina is no longer an issue. Agent Klaus complete, completed his mission. There's Eddie. Project Janus may now proceed unimpeded. Maxis presents a problem that must be dealt with. Her powers are growing. Uh, 25 grand on the box and still haven't gotten it. Does it look any different? Like, it, does it just say 
<coughs> BT90 or whatever the hell it is. Does it actually look any different? <clears throat> or does it have like a weird name? You know, like like when you pack a punch it, it, it uh it has a different name on it. I'm not sure. Fire stream. Appreciate it, man. Thank you, Angela. By the way, if anybody's here that hasn't subscribed yet, please do. It helps me out big time. It doesn't cost you anything. You stay subscribed to the channel for a couple of weeks. You decide whether or not you like it. From there, you just stay subscribed or you unsubscribe at that point. Not a big deal either way. Uh, totally up to you, though. I never go through these, like the medals. I mean, it's it's zombies, so it's not like you're... It's crazy hard to earn medal. Like, you didn't get a, a nuke medal. You know what I mean? Like, or you didn't go on a 25 streak. Kill 25 enemies or more within a short time. I mean, yeah, it doesn't really matter, but What does that mean? Kill five more enemies? This is, oh, Cerberus. I don't know. What do you guys like better, the Cerberus or the Chrysalax? Post notifications on. Appreciate it, man. Um, the Chrysalax is, is so cool looking and using the melee is great. The actual, you know, the, the, the gun part of it, the SMG part of it really kind of sucks. Um, the Cerberus is just, I mean, it kind of, like for me, wonder weapons are like, what will get me out of trouble? Like if I'm in, backed into a corner or push, you know, I get stuck in some little between two things, like what's going to get me out of that, that spot? Like, uh, thunder gun, obviously like pull the trigger, don't aim. You don't have, I mean, you can't aim it, but you know what I mean? Like just pull the trigger. Boom. Uh, the apothecary server. Great. Um, but between the servers and the Chrysalex, like even the servers, even though it's a gun and you're shooting, you know, in where your gun is pointed, it's shooting two bullets. That little ball that circles around the gun that shoots as well. And you don't have to be accurate. You can just literally just kind of, you know, back and forth, just hold the trigger down and bah, 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 bah. the Kraken. The Kraken's nice. Kraken's not amazing. I do like the Kraken, but the Kraken's not amazing. Um, but just between the Cerberus and the Chrysalax, like, I think I would take the Cerberus just because it's the better gun. And you get you can get yourself out of trouble if you get backed into a corner. Uh, the Chrysalax is, I mean, the gun is okay, but... You've got to be accurate, and it's just not that powerful. Like, it's just not that good. The melee part part of it is amazing, but it doesn't have a long range, like a really good long range uh, part of it. And you can, like, hold the left trigger down, and it sends the blade out, and it, you know, will chop up everything there, But which is great, too, but it's not that... It's not as powerful and you can't use that's like a cool that has a cooldown as well so the kraken with cryofreeze the kraken with cryofreeze is the like if you're doing the easter egg and you're in the boss fight like definitely 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 recommend putting cryofreeze on the kraken or whatever they call it in that like with the do they call it cryofreeze like this poison ice water you know what i mean ice fire and electricity or whatever so you have to put the poison on to shoot the the pipes down in the engine room to get the water to stop dripping out right um but then before you go into the boss fight definitely recommend using cryo on the kraken because dude it makes a huge difference huge difference because it just stops like everything that's rushing at you non-stop it just slows it all way down man way down you shoot the kraken out and just kind of everything in front of you just kind of goes doesn't like fully pause but it's like super slow motion and it just makes it way easier way easier to deal with especially when you're doing it solo uh not too sure to be honest but i know it's uh it, i can't see that's i really hate really 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 wish there was a way to move this stupid heart in the bottom right hand corner uh it's it's pretty solid for high runs yeah, yeah, I get you. Um, yeah, I honestly don't remember either. Um, but it, yeah, Cryo is definitely good on that. I mean, the ice version of it, whatever we're going to call it, doesn't matter. Uh, is very good on that. Um, okay. The game crashed. You know something? I'm so glad we just got finished because, dude, this is happening all the time with Cold War now. 
The last time I streamed that we did, um, I'm kind of working my way through these uh, when we have time to go back to Cold War. We did D Machina, then we did um, Firebase, and then we now we're on Mauer, and we'll do Forsaken, uh, and then we'll we'll probably do go back to Outbreak again as well. But I think like two out of the last three times we've played Cold War on stream, this has happened, and it's not me. It's not my connection. My connection's great. It's doing just fine, and my internet is strong it's good uh it's not me and there was a time so like two out of the last three times i've streamed this this has happened and also one time i was playing just offline not streaming and this happened as well so i don't know what's up with their servers man i think they're still like kind of i think or really do think they're getting ready to put things over onto uh xbox game pass and uh, I think that's what's going on because they've been trying to patch things on BO2 and BO3 and these disconnects are happening on Cold War. So that's my guess that that's what's happening is they're, it's whatever they're doing to get this stuff on Game Pass is causing these problems. Otherwise, there's really no reason there should be all of these issues. Like basically every time you play Cold War, now you get disconnected. So I don't know. Something's up there, but um, it's not great. Um Oh, there was something I was going to mention. I don't know. There's something I was going to mention. Updates, maybe? I don't know if it's updates so much as it is just uh, maintenance and porting things over. <clears throat> um, I mean, it could be, but that like that would be a lot of maintenance stretched out over some period of time here. I don't know. Oh, what I was going to say is, so in June, I believe Xbox, because, you know, Xbox now owns Call of Duty, right? Well, Microsoft, but you, you know what, the, what I'm saying. Um, so they have a... Yeah, we got it on Mitchell. Um, and the servers crashed again. <clears throat> I, don't, I, yeah, I don't know why it keeps happening. Anyway, so June is like Xbox is like... You know how PlayStation does their like state of play or whatever they call it. And then Xbox has their version of that, like... Whatever, this is what's happening. So you could expect Gulf War, Black Ops Gulf War, or Black Ops 6, or whatever they're going to call it. Pretty sure it's Gulf War, but whatever they're going to call it will happen at that event in June. So uh, we will definitely be live streaming it here on this channel. So, uh, I mean, I think we're pretty much all looking forward to, like desperately looking forward to, <laughs> um, to Gulf War so we can get some real zombies back. Uh, which would be great. But I think that announcement is coming in June. We might even get like a teaser trailer next month uh, in May at some point, but I'm not sure about that. If we do get a trailer next month, I think it will just be a teaser. It will be like a quick, you're not going to get too much information. A lot of like just quick glimpses. If you can remember back to um, the D Machina uh, teaser trailer that we got back in the day just little like there's like the flash you know like they went down into the um the particle accelerator room and like the lights kind of flickered on like the, all the zombies were just kind of hanging out there and just kind of not noticing you and then all of a sudden bah, they did you know but we didn't really know what was going on i think we might get something like that next month possibly but i think june is when we're going to get the full announcement and the only bad thing is is for for us zombies players is usually they do like the um w this is when they do like their full extended like here's a look at blah 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 they do campaign then they do multiplayer then they do zombies zombies is always last but if it's an overall black ops gulf war trailer we could get little bits of some zombies in there uh so anyways if they stream anything like that I, I will be streaming well they will be streaming stuff like that but i will be streaming it as well talking to you guys about it as we go through it doing like a trailer breakdown we'll kind of like take it frame by frame and really have a look uh i am definitely excited as well angelo i uh, can't wait for proper round base to return hopefully the maps are good i mean <sighs> from your lips to god's ears brother um okay <clears throat> let's leave it there nice clean walkthrough of uh this map Tomorrow, I'm not sure what we'll do, but uh, probably I think we're going to head on to MWZ because we want to get... The, I'm going to put that down. The, um, what is it like? What's it called? B, BP50 or something? Is that what it's called? 
uh, conversion kit. And we're also going to do the best gun. <coughs> And then we use the same stream, so that's that. That's definitely what we'll do tomorrow. And then Wednesday we'll do the um, BP fifty, BP fifty or BP ninety. I can't ever remember, man. Um, and then Wednesday will be the new weekly challenge, the conversion kit. So we'll unlock that on Wednesday. Um, all right, so that's tomorrow's stream. So uh, be here or be square, and then. Uh, that's it. So have a good night, guys. And uh, um, yeah, watch uh, watch Fallout. And once we're all done watching it, we can discuss it. All right, Nito, thank you. Angelo, thank you. Mitchell, Eric, um, Pug, Joe, all you guys. Appreciate you. Have a great evening, and I will see you tomorrow. Later. Bye.